YouTube, hello, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are on day 23. We're only gonna be doing side quests today. We're gonna start with the Intel and Corel, so we can finish off the Intel. I'm really exhausted at this point. I've been streaming, I think, 10 or 11 days in a row, and I'm, I'm getting a little tired. So we're doing a no-cam stream today. I got a couple of days off coming up, and then we'll be back on camera for day 24 when we likely get into the rest of the Queen's Blood matches. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Hope you're enjoying the series so far. If you haven't already, make sure you check out all the other videos in the series. You can check them out in the playlist on my profile or at the end of this video. I appreciate y'all being here. YouTube will be back in a bit. All right, let's just walk straight to our third Cactar statue. Is there anybody that needed um their weapons done? No, right? And, well, we did get a new weapon for Yuffie, right? The Crystalline Cross. Yeah, 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 yeah. Banishment. ATV spent on other commands increases damage dealt. Affinity changes with ninjutsu. Can use while airborne shares gauge with purification. Max levels three. Okay, so if you spend ATB on other commands, it increases the level of banishment. So you want to get it to level three then. And then obviously the uh, the element will change with the element that you give to Yuffie. Okay, right on. Seems easy enough. She's got another materia slot. Let's go ahead and give her, um, we've got so many good things working here. I do want to keep working on some of these other, like the precision defense is probably good. Let's start working that one up just so we have that ready to go. We need to equip some of the new materia as well. Let's give her Alexander. And then for weapon skills, debuff extension. She doesn't, she does have debuffs, right? I think I have Yuffie with debuffs, right? Time, innervation, yeah, 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 yeah. She's got buff spells too. And then bio and petrify, okay. Yeah, 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 okay. So yeah, debuff extension's good. Um, That's cool. I've never watched it. I think I may have turned it on once, went like, oh, that's not my thing, and then moved on. But I recognize that a lot of people like that show. Although you have to keep in mind too that I don't really like television in general, but. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you this, Harley. I have a above zero percent chance of knowing that information in the future. So if that if that's something that makes you feel good, then then I'm here for it. <laughs> um, when healing party members, okay, that doesn't really do her a lot of good though. Let's just give her the lightning and wind damage for now. I like I can always um, adjust this later. She can't, she's got to be able to have a better armband than this. Oh, this must have been the one that Kate Sith was using. Yeah, can't I transmute something better than something that has three slots? I guess I haven't looked at transmutation in a while. What am I missing here? Astral Remnant? I don't even know what that is. Cosmetite Ore, okay. I don't need to make any of those. Splendent Bracer. Okay. Oh. Yeah, like I said, I haven't really watched it, so I, I don't have a strong opinion on it at all. Uh, well, that's just better, yeah. Okay. Nothing else here. Okay. That's pretty much it. Explosions? Saint Luce Leaf. Need 30 to make an X potion. I guess X potions are pretty good. They do fully heal, so I shouldn't be I shouldn't complain. Oh, these I just need giga potions to make these. Can I how much giga potions can I make right now? Three. Yeah. Not worth it. We'll just wait. We'll just wait. <clears throat> Alright, now certainly that has to be an upgrade for UV. Um, which one was the one that I thought was better? I guess all of these are technically a little bit better. That one's, like, just better overall. This one, she loses some magic defense. I don't know that that matters too much, though. I prefer to have the materia slots. <clears throat> you just missed it, Rose. Sorry. Should I have another one of these... I should probably build another one of these up, too. I don't know how much I'm actually going to use those, though. Let's get another HP up, Morgan. And then... 
Oh, Comet. Dog, I completely forgot about Comet. Oh my god, I completely forgot I had that. Whoops. Um, let's give her... She already has poison and petrify. Let's just give her a barrier material just so she has the ability to like do some more buffing and debuffing. And then let's give um let's give Aerith Comet somewhere. <laughs> I'm sure there's a spot here somewhere. Um auto weapon material that I can probably Oh, I can get rid of jump. As fun as this has been. For what it's worth, for folks who haven't seen Aerith use jump, so fun. So worth it. <laughs> So worth it. Get rid of Comet. And then let's go ahead and do this. Get rid of this. And then I'm going to put the AP AP up materia or AP plus materia on this. Yeah. And help get this like maxed out quick. I hope so. That's the goal. The only way she's going to be super useful. So <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> All right, let's use the, uh, uh, we need to change that second party that has, uh, should be Barrett and Red 13, not, uh, hold on, I'm at settings. Yuffie Red 13. Oh, this was supposed to be Barrett and Kate Sith, but Kate Sith's not in the party anymore. Um, okay, well, we can, we can have, um, we can have Aerith be in that party. Instead of, uh, instead of Tifa. And just make that be our range team for now until Kate Seth comes back. I assume Kate Seth's coming back. Alright, where's it at? Oh, Godspeed, good luck. <laughs> I have great lawyers. <laughs> now that we've got the statue, we've just gotta find the rock. Oh goody! Oh, maybe that's not as far away as I thought it was. Can you jump over this cloud for me, please? No? All right. Up here? Yeah, can you climb all the way up? Can you do that? No? No, nah, it makes sense. It's okay. We'll walk around. We'll walk around. Ooh, looks like it might be farther than I thought. I don't really want to call the buggy though. I already did. Yeah, God only knows. I'm sure he'll rejoin the party eventually. Oh, he's gonna be in this cave. Where's that at? Exit. That looks sus. Hmm. Oh. Yay, trauma. Ah, <laughs> uh, maybe. Yeah. Well, everybody yesterday was just like, I feel bad for the cat. It's just like, do you though? Like, <laughs> is it underneath? You know, he's not actually a cat, right? I will say that he is a much more likable character in this game, so it's a lot uh, easier to feel sorry for him in this one, which they did a much better job of, obviously, which is nice. I don't even know how I would get under there. I'm just going to go to the scrapyard and see.
There's nowhere to go. God, I hate these quests so much. Like, it's so exhausting to like try to figure out where the fuck they expect you to go. Yeah, for sure. Forgive the enemy, Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's, it's definitely a lot easier to, to align with Reeve and, like, feel sorry for him, for sure. Because he's really not a bad guy, although he's complicit, which is a bad thing. Um... I'm just gonna fight these cactars and make me feel better. Oh, I need to plow the criteria back. Just like that. Let's do that really quick. Let it Tifa, right? Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, it's just showing that it's underneath, like, which doesn't do me any good. Like, I walk over here, and then they're just like, oh, yeah, now it's underground. You're just like, okay. And? Like, <laughs> like that doesn't tell me shit. Maybe there's, like, a, like a little uh, tunnel over here. Yeah, I suppose that's the point. No, because this isn't there isn't a tunnel over here. This is just where the scrapyard is. Where? Guys, dodge it if you're not if you're gonna get targeted. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of themes in this game that definitely, like, resonate with a lot of people, for sure. And to, that's definitely one of them. Great shit over here, dude. I'm about to look this up. I'm gonna keep it real. I'm not this, like... I'm not this worried about it. Whoa.
Apparently it is here somewhere. sudden I don't see a place to like go down into something though dude Yeah, this is it. If I jump down even, they're like a... I don't even see a thing to climb down. Yeah, at this point in the game, I'm largely over the needless wandering around, like, with no purpose and no reward. He's got a little mustache. <laughs> Botanical fiends of the succulent variety, mainly found in arid regions. These specimens grew to gargantuan sizes thanks to an abundance of fresh water at nearby oases. Oasises. Oases? Oases, probably. They jiggle their curly mustaches as they sprint and bound around the sands. Automatically becomes pressure while unleashing needle rain. Note that this attack also increases the potency of its thousand needles. Okay.
Level 3 up. Fiery Banishment, still only level 2, so you have to use 3 ATBs to level it up. That's crazy. Maybe it'll be red. <laughs> Excellent. Hey, check it out. I can still move my tail. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we can go back and unseal the door. We'll heal while we're there too. That's we cut. Healed. Head back to the cactars. <laughs> Just a red thirteen cactar pose. The moonwalk one would be pretty great. So is this going to be with a third character, or do I go back to Yuffie this time? I imagine this is just going to be hard mode versions of the ones we've already done. Uh, oh, there it is. Hey, what the hey, hell? How dare you betray me! <laughs> the Don raised you, and this is how you repay him? We're going to teach you a lesson, you ungrateful pricks. Don't fight the hand that feeds. <laughs> I hear you were using them as cannon fodder. Should they thank the Don for that too? <laughs> Tell them, Ezreal. Rat faced punk. You know who I am. Look, you're obviously not worthy of the treasure. So would you mind clearing out already? I'm expecting company. <laughs> the hell are you doing here? You shit me? If you bozos hadn't crushed my plans, I wouldn't have had to come here just to fix them. After he was so unjustly driven from the gold saucer, unjustly, yeah. The dawn was forced to wander these scorching sands. We stumbled upon this oasis and asked only for a bit of respite. But these guys. <sighs> oh, please. You goons tried to steal the treasure, and you got what was coming to you. Shut your mouth! <laughs> All 
the glimmers is gold. <laughs> and all that's gold belongs to the dot alone. Does it? He needs it to build his grand new empire, Corneoland. Come on, just give it to me already. Don't make me beg for it. Cause I will. <laughs> please, please, please. Well, how did he even get in here? Done! Let's retreat for now. We let them do the legwork. Then once they've got the treasure, we swoop in and snatch it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's our cue. We'll see ourselves out. Au revoir! Bam out. Bam out. God. <laughs> Sorry about all that. <laughs> now that the Don and his crew hit the road, shall we? Why not? Bring it on. It is you, Vegan, okay. I've got something real special in store for you. Do you? Hm. Ah! <laughs> you kidding? They're just different colors. <laughs> Don't look so special to me. Here comes Chadley and to tell us Those that they are, in fact. Cactuars. They're rare variants. Their unique coloration has led them to be venerated by their peers as heroes. I must implore you all to collect data on them for me. <laughs> and with that, let the third trial begin. They are, in fact, old. Oh, man. Dark Matter's in this game? Okay. Man, that didn't dodge it? Okay, that sucks. I thought the boomer form just got out of the way. Do I have any like actual magic spells like a windstorm one? No. It is a lot of numbers. <laughs> Yeah, big comb. Big, big comb. Oh, we still need um, play magic here. We're gonna need the doppelganger again. Magic. Okay. Good for me. Wait, what? 
Wait, what? Didn't they switch to physical? Got the 100% Leviathan DLC, nice. Fun. Oh, they're all switching to magic. the max hell yeah brother let's go <laughs> first try fuck this game <laughs> Rashi, you told that one yesterday was it yesterday maybe two days ago never mind <laughs> All right, you're good to see you. Take this welcome on in. <laughs> Ryan, welcome on in. Good to see you. Really good to see you as well. Hope everybody's doing well tonight. Well, he wasn't in here last time. Oh, I see. I didn't know this was her stream. My bad. <laughs> you're naked. Oh, Lord. Careful. I don't know if you can say that on Twitch. I think you can get in trouble for that. Good to see you, Ryan. Hope you're doing well. What's the fastest? It's probably just this tower. The cactar is naked. You're technically not wrong. <laughs> You're technically not wrong. I suppose we probably need the buggy for this, huh? Let's see. Yeah. Just go straight and then have to hang around. Master, welcome on in. Good to see you. Happy Monday, everybody. Hope everybody had a nice weekend. I would if I could. She's back there getting sick instead. <laughs> yeah? We've actually been getting from a new pizza place. I won't, I won't dox myself, obviously, but I'll shoot you a message afterwards as long as I remember, which I probably will. We've been getting from a pizza place over by... Uh, yeah, anyway, yeah, I'll let you know. <laughs> it's pretty good though. Cactuar rock awaits. The treasure of the sands is almost yours. Hang in there. Do, 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 do. All right. Over that way. Um. Where do I think this is going to be? Let's try going to this Chocobo stop and seeing where the, um, where the thing goes. They really have, haven't they? Like, Lemmy and I were just ha talking about that today. Like, when we were walking around the apartment complex and all the, uh, all the big-sized trucks are just 
you know, leaving their noses over the sidewalk. <laughs> yeah. Pretty wild. That means this next one's with Aerith, by the way, which I'm not excited about. That one's probably going to be a pain in the ass. And then I think we hang a left here, because this is where the, um... Like, over here. Yeah, that seems like the right way. And then maybe as we go down, we'll just hang around here. It should work, right? I suppose I could just go to the Proto Relic if I think that's closer, but... Oh, can you really? That's dope! It makes the cushions actually useful? That's fun! Because you can transmute the cushions, too, with the materials you find in the wild. That's cool. That makes sense, too, though, right? Because, like, if they didn't do that, that probably would have been a pain in the ass. It feels like we're not going the right way anymore. I'm gonna go to the, um... I'm gonna go to this. Yeah, this seems like the right call. Oh. Ha! Ah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> God. Yeah, I mean, I typically don't want to run it over kids. Oh, it, this just literally ran me right back to the uh, Chocobo stop. Okay. I clearly overthought this. Oh, cool. You know, they released a, um, what was the hybrid one they released? It was a, um, was it the Maverick? I think it was called. Oh, I bet you it's up here. Um, but that was a smaller truck that I didn't mind. I thought it was kind of nice. And it was cheaper, too. I think it was, at the time of release, I think it was only 19000 which, like, 19000 is still a lot of money, but, like, for a car. And it was a hybrid, too, so it actually got decent gas mileage, too. Oh, this has got to be the right way. Look how convoluted this is. That wasn't Toyota, obviously. That was, that was Ford, but... It's interesting. Are you serious? They added it? That's so, that's so dumb. <laughs> oh, it's literally right there. I see it. This one was way easier. Yeah, I think that was uh, pretty similar to the Maverick. That's cool, though. I'm glad that that's, that's catching on. That's That's nice. Oops, I have to hold it longer. Okay, I was holding the button, please. There we go. <laughs> That's fair. Ah, <laughs> oh, cute. Got little flowers. Where you going? Where are you going? With me. Oh, hey, I can't. <laughs> I can counter fire it though. That's good to know. I did not know that. That's cool. Allow me. Botanical fiends, yada yada yada. Having fallen hopelessly in love with the gentlemanly gigantars, these specimens have somehow forced themselves to grow just as large. Characterized by the dazzling flowers in their heads and their unparalleled passion for dancing. Uh, so it's, it's the same exact thing as the last one though. Okay. That's <laughs> I tried to block in time, but I didn't get there. Oh, I didn't get second block in time. Axel, welcome on in. Good to see you. Um, I wasn't a counter I love going. Uh, let's just defend the end, honestly. Let's switch it up. Let's finish this. 
Bye bye. <laughs> Red's just excited. <laughs> oh, it's all of them. Oh, so it's like that. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Everybody do the cactar pose. Bladesmen of legend. Huh? Bladesmen of what now? Legend. Which is why KG has asked you to undertake this trial. To see if you're worthy of said title. Uh, okay. I'm detecting increased power activity. <laughs> In the last game, you, you might be able to. to I guess we'll have to wait and see. They will hold nothing back. But I have the utmost confidence that you will prevail. As you always do. Gee, thanks, Chadley. Oh, so I can get. Hey, that'll do. <laughs> All right, let's go. Well, I think it's just those two. I just happen to have them in my party. <laughs> uh, okay, so we go back to the reactor. Can I just fast travel there? No, that makes sense. Yeah. How'd I get there last time? <laughs> uh, okay. I guess we'll just go here. Oh. Guess I'll break open this stuff real quick. Yeah. Uh, Go. <laughs> yeah, well, it's fine. I'll just go here. Gate auto pickup behind the game plus. That doesn't make any damn sense. Yeah, they did a great job with the buggy. They did a great job with the tiny Bronco, too. Sounds like the big guy's really struggling over there. Still better keep our distance. <laughs> Everybody out. All right. Let's um let's take the time to heal up really quick. I was just going to go to the um the bench again, but we'll just heal using the uh mega potions. Faster. Onward. I was so bad with the Earth one last time. I imagine I will be just as bad this time. I think with this one, I might just be satisfied with the stage one, and I'll get the uh, the other one offline. I'm not wasting potions. I wasn't at full health. I used them exactly how they needed to be used when I was injured. Welcome, folks. To the final trial. Hi, Ezreal. You've done well to survive the spiny onslaught that was unleashed upon you. Quote the Book of okay. Kings. Delivered to this man from a realm unknown. The treasure of the sand shall be bequeathed to the bladesmen of legend. For generations, we have observed our duty to keep the treasure safe until the appointed hour. Could you be the bladesmen of legend that the scriptures foretold all those years ago? You bet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can do it from the menu, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I thought you knew that. Oh, those are big bitches. You will have proven yourself the treasure's heir. 
And with that, let the final trial begin! Oh, fuck it is, Aerith. Why can't it be Cloud? The Cloud doesn't have magic. I know. I know. Gotta be a mix. Aerith technically doesn't have physical either, but they don't really care about that, do they? Alright, which one was the light one? Was it L2? Yeah. Alright. Alright. Get the chrono in. Oh, you just have to slap it. Okay. One more shot. The thing I tried to slap it. Every little bit helps. Oh, these are. No. Here it comes. You move. Ready? Go on! That's it! Too much? Oh, interesting. Okay. I keep my distance if I were you. Mind backing off a bit. Yeah, they're weak to like physical attacks, yeah. This one's for you! I mean. Here it comes. Hey, you asked for it. Right. It was a little bit of an odd choice, but like. I keep my distance if I were you. This would make you stronger. No, you all can come back. Lend me your strength. Oh shit. Um. Backing off a bit. Yeah, it's okay. I'll take the damage. Get him. That's it. This one's for you. Okay. Right, stop running. Go on. Here he comes. One more shot. You who? Get him. Too much. Thank you. Hey, you asked for it. Oh boy, okay. I should have blocked that. Sorry about that. Man, this is so slow. Is there no faster way to do this? I guess I could have used an actual spell. Oh no, I can't. That was the last one, huh? Yeah. This one doesn't like... I don't know, it doesn't bother me too much, but it's just like... It's whatever. That's that was right. only rank one, that wasn't even rank two, I'm yeah. Completely convinced. I'll go back to that later. Just as the Book of Kings foretold, the Bladesman of Legend yeah. has come at last.
This is the last intel piece. That is clearly Gilgamesh's helmet. Actually, there's one more favor I wanted to ask. Hold it right there! <sighs> Nobody do anything stupid. I'm afraid that fancy book of yours is out of date. Oh no, he's got a gun! I know deserving of that treasure is this one right here. God, Cornegum! <laughs> now they have two guns. You heard him. Give me my sparkling spoils. <laughs> uh oh. What in the hell? Right. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, I get it. You They're Genji items. Okay, me, that makes sense. My prize. What kind of circus is this? A large one. Stand back. Protecting this treasure is our sworn duty. Yeah, who needs a map? <laughs> 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 Get him, cactars! Oh, hell yeah! Punch him again! Who's <laughs> next? He was did. Just a technical knockout. We've got our sights set on a new hey, TKO frontier. stole a win. Bye -bye. We'll rebuild stronger than ever, and once we do, <laughs> once we do, we're gonna crush you and your little cacti too. Your days are numbered. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, dude. Anyway. Bye, Don. That favor I was about to ask. Sure. Would you mind sparring with me? Wait for I real. Go around with the legend himself. See how I stack up. Why not? Yeah, sure, I'm down. G versus G, that's right. <laughs> sure, I'm in. Let's do it. This will be fun. No, hold on. Hey. Let's go. At your All right, let's goblin beatdown. Ow! An eccentric goblin capable of speech and interest in human culture. It is his ancient duty to lead Karel's cactars in protection of the treasure of the sands. Dealing with his post parry attack or his goblin beatdown will pressure him. If you fail to stagger him after a certain amount of time, he will unleash his powerful whammo attack. Okay. <laughs> Hey, get out of there. <laughs> I can't fight you in there. Get back out here. Come on. Let's do this. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, I rolled into that. Leave it to me. Wow. Yeah. That's kind of a dick. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Honestly, yeah. Let's switch it up. It's over. Didn't have a weak switch. Almost got him. Might not even need to use this. Um. Oh. One of your party members go down, you can do that backline command. I completely forgot about that. No trial could be a match for the bladesmen of legend. That's a fun fight. Congratulations. The treasure of the sands is yours. Thanks, Kid G. Keepers. Our work here is done. Guess we'll have to come up with a new fairy tale for ourselves. Yeah. Good luck with that. Hope we meet again someday. I'd be down for a rematch, too. Considering how many sure. people we've seen back from Remake, I imagine we will see you in the next game. <laughs> see ya. Bam. Cactars have presented you with a special challenge befitting the Bladesman of Legend. Oh, no. That's gonna be offline. <laughs> That's gonna be offline. We have completed the Corel Intel. Wahoo. All right, so this is the last Proto Relic. The right. <laughs> Yeah, what do you got for me now, Gilgamesh? Still scratching your butt, huh? Let me guess. The Sand Giant. That was you? Drawn were you by Genji's call, and whither did it lead you but those sweltering sands? Am I right? Sort of. Let us share a drink beneath the stars. I'll pass. Huh. I offer to reward your fruitless labors, yet you refuse to accept. Thieves thirst only for spoils. Excuse me? Huh. You've absconded with not every Genji piece I own. Is there a name more befitting than thief? To wit, you've made off with six. My helmet, breastplate, my gloves, and greaves. However, one item eludes your avaricious grasp. Oh, there's another one? Behold, name, my Genji shield. Oh. That another proto relic? You fool! Tis the Aegis of Genji. That checks out. Once the full set is again in my possession, my memory shall at last return. And I will know not only whence I came, but whither I must go. <laughs> right, doubles as a ramen bowl. And thus, in the name of Genji, I issue one final challenge. Face me, the true bladesman of legend, Gilgamesh. I love we you, shall dude. duel on the Isle I call home. <laughs> I eagerly await the day our blades 
Oh. Over by Junon. <laughs> right. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be my most fancy keyboard though, and it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. Everybody's gonna be like, "Wow, that's so nice." I'd be like, "Yeah, it's useless. I put my keys in it." You can throw your wallet in there. It's okay. Use it as a charcuterie board when we have company. I've detected the sudden emergence of an unknown landmass. Improbable though it may seem, a new island has appeared out of thin air. Okay. <laughs> Same. Swordsmen and those otherworldly armaments. Who knows what data you'll collect once you make landfall? Oh, I'm detecting an uncontrollable pounding in my chest. Cloud. The end of our quest for the proto relics draws near. But I hope you will continue to assist me in exploring our world. I really... I'm going to keep it 100 with you, Chad. I actually thought that this was going to be the end, but... I suppose I was foolish. I don't even get a trophy for completing all this shit. All right. Cool. God, where is it? Oh, it's in the it's in the ocean. It's just over here. All right. Interesting. <laughs> okay. We can actually, I forgot we can fast travel to the ports using the tiny Bronco now. All right, well, let's do the, um, let's do the side quest first. We'll do that. We'll do that section later. Um, where was the side quest in Corel? Was it in, was it in Coastal of Soul? Yeah. Mayor, oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. I remember now. And we'll heal up when we get there. We'll save the Gilgamesh stuff, because I imagine that's going to be pretty involved. We'll save the Gilgamesh stuff for later. Be with you in just a second, Mr. Mayor. I need to go uh, have a nap. Both in game and in real life. Well, have a nap. Oh, really? That's cool. You gotta love the voice actors with range, right? There's no finer sound. Oh, is this... Is this the last one? Lewis melodies are all the more pleasing when played on the piano. Thank you for sharing such joy with the world. So, you've mastered all of our pieces. Well done. On behalf of the association... Oh, sick. Thanks for the healing material. Dope. ...our deepest gratitude and this token of our appreciation. I'd like you to have this, too. An expression of my own personal admiration. At a young age, I lost my sense of sight. Oh no. And so silence <laughs> became my window to the world. The chirping of birds, the rustling of leaves, the trickling of rain. Each a melody unto itself. Each a ray of light that pierced the darkness and brought color to the pitch black world in which I had come to live. Hmm. By playing the piano, I learned to speak from the heart in the language of music, to share my own light with the world. And I hope that I may continue sharing that light, spreading the joy of music to all who will listen. Fun. Written on this page is the music that illuminates my world. 
right before I screw it up. <laughs> I, I'm using I in the royal sense where it's like, <laughs> you know, we all had to screw it up, I'm sure, but. And weave your enchanting melody for many years to come. Inspired by Cloud and Tifa's performances, Aerith and Yuffie have also decided to try their hands at tickling the ivories. Cool. Piono Virtuo... Piano... Piono? Piono. 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 All right. Just trying to play the fucking song. <laughs> Got a trophy. All right. Let the battles begin. It is two stars harder than the Aerith seam. Only one star harder than this one. This one was pretty tough. The two legs, nothing to it. So I bet you this is going to suck. 256 notes is easily the most that we have to play. Only a minute and 42 seconds. This is going to go fast. Okay. I'm ready. This is going to be tough. <laughs> Man. We weren't doing like that badly, but I definitely lost the rhythm there. This is another one of those songs that I, I, I'm i going to struggle with because the, the notes that you're playing aren't on beat with the entire song. It drives me nuts, man. This is the stuff that I hate. Is that good enough, maybe? Cool. Okay, great. We did it. Everybody clap. Woohoo! We did it. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, do I get anything for that, Dorian? Where there is music and a piano on which to play, there to. Yeah, no kidding. Oh. Piano is here for you. No, that, you that was just add your own unique color to the soundscape of our world. I didn't have to do that. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, Dorian. That hurts my feelings a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Hurts my feelings a little bit, Dorian. I'm not gonna lie. That's okay though. That's okay. We're just gonna do a side quest. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Where you at, Mayor? What you want? That's true. That mess. Is there anything I can do for you? I will not be getting a uh, a star in that one. Let's ask about Professor Hojo. 
I certainly wasn't expecting the professor to do something like that. Still, I'm a simple man, and from what I gather, his experiment was of great scientific import. Are you so fucking I serious? Done without the collateral damage. It fills me with pride to be the mayor who holds a special footnote in Shinra's illustrious history. I'm sorry, I can't hear you over the, uh... Never mind. I wasn't gonna say anything nice. Oh! That ungrateful schlub. I hope the hero is enjoying his 15 minutes of fame. It won't last, and neither will his hilltop roach trap. Just give it time. What a prick. <laughs> there were a few injuries, yes, but no guests were killed. In all honesty, the professor did us a service by ridding us of those roads. The freaks were ruining our ambience. Shinra also did us a service by providing us with a generous do uh, uh, Forget I said anything. Mm-hmm. Well, all that ugliness is in the past. Let's look to our future. Mm -hmm. One that's bright and mutually beneficial. Is it? I'm not buying it. Thanks, you oh, I'm on board. I can sell you on the idea of lending the Merc I've hired a hand. What's this about a Merc? Oh, God, it's Kyrie. Oh, that's your associates. <laughs> that makes things easier. You see, some fiends popped out of the water and assaulted a group of innocent beachgoers the other right. day. The young lady agreed to exterminate those pests, mm -hmm. only to go on a bender at a bar on the beach. I paid her a handsome sum up front, too, so I intend to get my money's worth. Oh, boy. Oh, and after you've gotten rid of those monsters, as a personal favor, I want you to take care of that merc. Uh... You want us to what? She's been spending the money More I paid her to do Chalice, thanks for the raid. Welcome on in, Raiders. For those who don't know me, my name is G Mundy. You can call me G Mundy. You can call me Gary, whichever you prefer. We're currently playing through Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are on Chapter 12, doing a bunch of side quests and stuff. So if you're trying to avoid spoilers, this is your warning. We're doing some Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. So appreciate you joining with the raid. Hope everybody's doing well today. Welcome on in, everybody. We do a variety of content here, including challenge runs, Pokemon games, Final Fantasy marathons, charity streams, the whole nine yards. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Maya, welcome on in. Ratboy, good to see you. Urkimus, good to see you as well. Hope you're doing well, Urkimus. Good to see you. Lundy, welcome on in. Chalice, how was your stream? Yeah, cheers, Urk. I appreciate it. Hope you had a nice weekend. Hope you had a great Monday. Nope, not today. Not today. I've been streaming 11 days in a row. I'm tired. So instead of canceling today, I'm, I'm a Kirby. Welcome on in, everybody. OBS port, don't know. OBS, stupid OBS. Is a bitch. <laughs> Is a bitch. Each time she learned there are some <laughs> folks you don't cross. Hmm. Agreed. I've no doubt you'll find her at that damned bar. Do give her my regards. Wow. All right, so we don't like him. So well, let's see what Kyrie's got herself into this time. Tour Costa del Sol in style with our wheelies. There's trouble in paradise. <laughs> June Junon was kind of a bust, but I'm back and better than ever. Same goes for my advertising. <laughs> so don't you worry about me, my fellow Merc. Aren't you supposed to be working? <sighs> really? Another lecture? For a 20-something, you sound like my grandma. 
Well, you took the job. I have been working. Thank you very much. I figured out where the fiends are probably gonna show. Oh, did you? Left is to have someone else do the cleanup. Let me guess. Me? Exactly. So don't try to pin it on this mark. The whole situation would be resolved if you did your job. Nobody likes a slacker. Man, this girl's got some nerve. And coming from me, that's saying a lot. Very true. But if we don't do something, it's your good name that's gonna end up taking the hit. Mm -hmm. She's got a point. <laughs> so, here's the deal. Your thoughtful boss has dug up a recipe. You know, Kyrie, I was I was actually really close to defending you because that mayor's a piece of shit. But like, I am gonna defend you because he's worse. But like, you're not clearing the bar by much. Gather the materials and make some for yourself. Okay. Here, when you're done, head to the off limits beach across town for some monster baiting. Monster baiting. You're coming. Not to be confused with. Can't do this alone. According to the anyway, it looks like you're gonna need to get some rare ass monster parts. And I do mean rare. Probably can't find them around here. Oh, did I say probably? Are you kidding? In order to do Kyrie's job for her and exterminate the fiends, scaring away would-be beachgoers, you must first lure them out by using a special type of monster bait. First, investigate life springs in the Gagaga and Cosmo Canyon regions to discern the locations of classified foes dwelling there. Once you best them in combat, you can then transmute the legendary bait from the materials they leave behind. Okay. Maybe I got a couple of extra. That would be kind of dope. Nope. Oh, I did get one. Okay. So I need to beat the Marlboro again. That's not that bad then. Okay. So all you have to do is go back to Gungaga and I don't even remember where the Marlboro is, to be honest with you. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. Where are you? Uh, shake the earth. No. Mako. This was this it. Oh, that's it. That's it. It should be pretty quick. What up, homie? Here we go. Yeah. How did I press? Oh, you have to beat up its mouth. That's right. Wait. It's not when you can break its mouth? Oh, now it is. Okay. Um, yeah, we can use, we can use the energy zone here. This should be enough. It's your turn now. Oh, she doesn't have, um, well, this will work. enough <laughs> yeah, all right let's make the legendary bait and then back to Corel where was this at 
Oh, it opens up that gate by where we fought that intel before. Okay, that's easy enough. Cool. <laughs> yeah, we did a little bit of damage. Man, we were level 25 when we were in this area. Jesus Christ. Feels like a lifetime ago at this point. I forgot how long we were in chapter nine, nice though. Sign of trouble. Maybe we've got to lure him out. Let's see if those baddies take the bait. Welcome to the off limits beach. Oh, we can fast travel here now. That's nice. Yes. You know, the other only reason I have one of those horns is because I wanted to see if I can morph it. Mm -hmm. The Jabberwocky from uh, Cosmo Canyon. Because I hadn't used morph in a while. This bait's a bust. <laughs> Not a bust. Not a bust. Spoke too soon. Alligators with fins, huh? Give me dice. That's good. He's trying to eat me. Look at him. Best do right. Carnivorous creatures that live near coasts, their raging appetites compel them to never let go of their prey once seized. Having lost their feeding grounds to the development of leisure resorts in recent years, they've begun lashing out at humans responsible. Explaining their elemental weakness will pressure them. Inflicting a certain amount of lightning damage will cause them to attack less frequently. Oh, that's fun. It's an interesting, um... No, 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 no. No, I said no. This one's for you. All right. Um, well, it said we can use thunder magic to make him attack us frequently, so... I'm not gonna lie, it does seem to have attacked me immediately. <laughs> she does have access to Blizzaga. I kind of want to get Blizzaga off here. How did Slow get put down? Time. Sorry. Oh. I so severely underestimated how much uh, that did. <laughs> Anything else? Better go tell Kyrie. Right. So, uh, what about the mayor's other request? You know, the whole take care of her thing? I mean, lying isn't the greatest, but she doesn't deserve that. Not yet, at least. Wow. Damn, Cloud. It's a little harsh. I mean, I feel you. I understand, like, the frustration, but maybe, maybe chill. <laughs> Holy shit, dog. Like, chill out. It's okay. Not that serious, dude. Woo! No. Only while I'm on the wheelie, huh? Yeah! Dang it. I just slash it. Save your aching feet and ride a wheelie instead. And you know what? I didn't even realize they probably updated the mini games here too, huh? <laughs> Welcome back, fellow work. So, did you take care of those baddies? I sure did. Oh, perfect. In that case, I'm gonna go tell the mayor so I can claim my reward. Hold it. Huh? The mayor had another request. <laughs> Uh, what was it? Said we should take care of you. He what? No, this has to be a joke. 
right? Hate to break it to you, Kyrie, but this is no laughing matter. <laughs> Wait, hang on a sec. Please. Why would he ask you, my own business partner, to take me out? What did I do wrong? <laughs> Cast off my work is yours, pose as a merc, or think long and hard. What do you think you did wrong? I like that one. Oh god, I don't know. Oh Wait lord, I should have known. I should have known better. This is, this is my, my this is my fault. This it's is my bad. So gorgeous that you can't take your eyes off me, distracting you from your mercenary duties, right? Yeah. No, this is my fault. That's the best you can come up with. <laughs> no, wait! that I called myself a mercenary? Or was it that I pressured you into doing all the dirty work? Or that I wasn't giving you a big enough cut? Do you want to die? <laughs> <laughs> Forgive my granddaughter for her questionable sense of humor. <laughs> Grandma? What's up? I didn't think we'd see her again. Off to enjoy the sun when I heard a merc was in town. How are you enjoying the sun in that outfit? a visit and... Well, <laughs> if Cloud hadn't come to this your is the angel of the lady, slums, by the way, would have been a goner. <sighs> Don't be fooled. That mayor's no model citizen. He's as wicked as they come. You need to pick your targets with care. Yeah, yeah. He's told me a thousand times. Make it a thousand and one, because you still don't get it. <laughs> Look, I'm doing my best out here, okay? It's just that some things are beyond my control. You're the one who doesn't get it. No matter Ow. what I try, every single time, it's... I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh, Kyrie. You know I only want what's best for you. And if you're to be the next guardian angel of the slums... Honestly... I kind of get where Kyrie is coming from here. So I say what? Parents want kids to listen to them because they know what's best, but they don't. They just want us to do whatever they tell us. Oh. And that really, really sucks, you know? Oh. Mm. I mean, that's that's a fair point, but I don't think that's what was happening there. To the guardian angel Have you been paying attention to what Kyrie has been doing the last... I guess she wasn't there for the other Not times, mine. huh? If he wasn't. No matter how much I Never mind. Follow in your footsteps that makes more make sense. Proud, I can't. Because I'm not you. I'm me. <laughs> I don't know. You certainly sound just like me. <laughs> oh? Oh. Forgive me, dear. I know I shouldn't push you. Or her whole ass fucking toe is just out. You see that? Her fucking shoe's broken open. I think your technique. She's so got the fucking this? grippers hitting out there. That's how she spends time in the sun. Shall we head home? The people need us. Okay, let's go. <laughs> in any case, thanks for looking out for my little Merc. I'll be sure. taking her back to Midgar. I don't know that that's a good idea either. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Trying's about all I can do. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna fuck around with the mayor first? Thank you for stepping in back there. Uh, I was just so pissed I had to say something. Lord. <laughs> Stay strong. You too. Girl power and all that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, partner. Coming. Actually, let's say we look for one last job before we leave. Oh, Pausers. I've got an idea. You see, I dug up a little dirt about that mayor. Hell yeah, Kyrie. <laughs> so, what do we do now? We go and tell the mayor we took care of the merc. Just like he wanted. It is true. She is gone. Exercise around. 
Understood? Yes, sir. <laughs> That's true. We're likely aren't gonna see her again. I wanna roll through that so badly. <laughs> it still amazes me. It's like we're what? How many hours into this game are we now? We're uh we're a Kirby amount of hours into this game, eighty two. And we are, um, I'm still just blown away by the amount of detail in the towns. Oh, I doubt that. <laughs> For a whole Kirby, yep. It's true. Friends, I heard you ran that little swim. Friends, out of huh? Town. I would have preferred a more final farewell, but she's gone. Fuck off, I dude. Think. As a token of my thanks, accept this reward. Sir, we've got oh, trouble. thanks. See for yourself. They even found the secret safe. It's empty. What? You better head back. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> we hereby bequeath your ill-gotten gains to the more deserving masses. And it's signed, the first and third guardian angels of the slums, radiant saviors of the sun kissed. No Hell way. yeah. Get him. You go, girls. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Not to the big blue circle with Yuffie yet. All right. So is that it for... What? There's another one? Didn't it say six out of seven? The hell? I guess it unlocked another side quest. Trouble in Paris. <laughs> Not quite. Not quite. That's in Go Square, okay. Wait, is it not gonna go square? Where's the fucking, where's the board at? Oh, the board's in the dust bowl. It's not in gold saucer. Yeah. My bad. Doom. Oh, the side quest is here. Well, I guess I could quickly get the uh, the last thing from Chadley here. That was excellent work, and through your efforts, the ways in which Shinra shaped these lands for weal and for woe are now much more clearly understood. Of special interest is the gold saucer's effect on the soil. A testament to the ecological impact of technology. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for your invaluable contributions. I'm gonna be honest with you, Chadley. I don't know if it's because, like... I've completed everything, that I'm less annoyed by you now. But I, it is true, I am less annoyed. Did I ever finish the combat stuff with him? I don't think I did, right? I'll have to do that, too. What? Did 
There's more enemies in the regions that we haven't fought yet? That's odd. I did do them all. I just haven't done the Nebel Intel thing yet. Which is probably for the best anyway, because there's there's even another one in the grasslands. Maybe, yeah. I look forward to seeing what new discoveries you make in your travels. Oh, it's fucking Leslie. You're that guy from Corneos. Leslie. Uh, hey, Leslie, you what look like you got fucked up a here? bit. You look like you've been through hell. Got wind my girl might be out this way. Had to follow up, see if there was truth to it. How's Wild Market holding up? You saw. After the plate fell, the trio opened the place to refugees. Town tripled in size. Man, if you thought it was lively before. Unfortunately, when Corneo pulled up stakes, he took all that Shinra money with him. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Wall Market's days are numbered. Hmm. Madame M's trying to work her magic, but I don't know. Sector 7 uh -huh. is still a mess. Probably gonna stay that way for a while. Expressway collapsed right after the plate. Then out of the blue, the company decides it needs a new president. Seems pretty clear Shinra doesn't give a shit about Sector 7. Undercity especially. But that shouldn't come as a surprise. Right. The people have stepped up though. Clearing the rubble, helping the injured, locating the missing. I forgot, like, canonically, this actually isn't too far after, like, when you leave Midgar. In case I didn't tell you, her name's Merle. After you Merle? left Wall Market, I started asking around. Yeah, sounds good, Harley. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. I shouldn't have bothered. Even if they did have info, they're not dumb. They wouldn't dare blab to a former Corneo crony. Yeah. But I was able to find out she wasn't at Midgar anymore. And ever since then, I've been moving from town to town, looking for leads. Okay. So the thing is, Gus is running a special competition. Man, fuck Gus, dude. Surprise. Word around the Dust Bowl is she fled here for the Midgar. woman's the prize. It's just a hunch, but I think she might be who I'm looking for. She's a prize. Thank That's you, Tifa. Sick. Gus is a real piece of shit, to put it mildly. You do that? <laughs> Monsters did. Oh. Gus is calling it a party, but it's an excuse to see blood. Lots of it. He pits people against fiends. And his money's on the ladder. I lost. So this is where you guys come in. Okay. Join the party, win, and free that woman. Hmm. Still a merc, aren't you? No reason not to. Yeah, for real. I was wondering where he was. It's, I mean, we're, what, 80 plus hours into the game? We'll do it. I love Tifa just stepped forward towards Cloud. That's all she needed to do. No words. Five to sign up. Okay. In the ring, though, it's one on one. <sighs> and humans only, I'm afraid. Oh, that's fucked. I can't use red? Man. You, and so is the woman. If anyone can put Gus in his place, it's Wall Market's reigning champs. Yeah, all right. I could probably do that. Just downstairs. I guess I should heal real quick. Don't even think about the snitch. You feel like your own That's right. Looking for a place to hold. Sleep real quick. Enjoy your stay in hell, brother. Fuck you. Did you Dickhead. see Wu-Tai's broadcast? <laughs> Sounds like things are about to get very interesting. Personally, I can't wait. Pog. I'm so glad I looked. What the fuck? I wouldn't mind you stoking more interest in Queen's blood. <laughs> Remember, it's next to the gods to young and 
Oh, I just jump over sick. See if they have new fights here too, just so I can kind of get a lay of the land of what I'm looking at here. No, okay, good. Challengers are always welcome. You here to join the party? Let's see what we got. The winged one, solo about for you, fee. Can I readjust equipment? No, okay, I threw it outside. You chicken? You wanna just be quiet for just five seconds, Mr. Mr. Man? <laughs> like calm the fuck down. Jesus Christ. I passed it. I literally walked right past it. Just in case uh just in case y'all's instinct was right. And that this will be end up being like the the enemies we need to assess. We'll keep uh we'll keep switching out the assess earrings. Alright. No. Today's challengers are the champion of Chocobos, the racing ace himself, Cloud the Knife, and Cloud the Knife? The Ginyu well, first, basically, yeah. Versus my personal pick of the fiercest, most ferocious fiends you have ever seen. Oh, I'm probably going to lose. To witness a brutal bloodbath of untold proportion. Let the shit hit the fan. Woo! I need uh I need ice against these guys. I don't know if Yuffie's um ninjutsu is gonna be enough. Let's see. healing either is I think we can, if I don't get hit by one of those Gravigas early, I think we'll be okay. Obviously having a healing spell would be good too, but that's no big deal. We might be able to, oh, do I just lose? Doesn't let me just re-challenge from there. Okay. <laughs> Let's see if we can do it one more time without putting a healing material on. I think we'll be okay though. I could always give her the barrier material that has Mana Ward too, and that would cut the Gravaga by half, but I don't think that's necessary. We should be okay. You can dodge that with brumal form. We dodged it before, but I could always just put elemental and gravity on too. That's probably the easiest thing to do. 
That way we're immune to it. Oh, well, I guess his element. It's el gravity's not an element, though, is it? Would that even work? We're here. Maybe it's warding. Well, it doesn't say gravity works. Oh my god. So many materia. Alright, let's start taking gravity. I doubt elemental works, but let's take a look and see if first at least. No, it doesn't. Um, Warding doesn't work with it. HP absorption doesn't. Autocast, no. Magic efficiency and all that obviously doesn't matter either. Okay, that doesn't matter. Uh, what did she have before? Oh, this one, the poison petrify. And then we'll give her healing materia. That should be fine. Petrify, poison petrify, empowerment. Yeah, okay. No way to block the gravity damage then. again well i mean worst case scenario we could always put the ice material on there too and that that would stagger them pretty quick because you just have to do enough damage with the ice ice magic or ice damage to stagger them so i i think even banishment might be enough Should be okay this time. This calls for more Yuffie. I think we got it. She's got a lot of fun tech, man. Like being able to dodge like gravity spell, like an unblockable spell with that brumal form is very cool. Okay, so now we just have to put the assessment here onto Aerith. You chicken? I have to redo all of these. Uh... Is that your deal? You here to join. I'll have to redo all the, um, what's it called? Material setups, but that's okay. Versus the... Oh, fireballs. Fireballs. They're gonna be bombs. Okay. So we just need to get, um... You chicken? Is that your deep? Elemental with fire on her. Uh, let's do this. Go to Aerith. Let's get rid of... Auto weapon and give her elemental. I think this one's at level two. Oh, it's only at level one. 
I only need 300 AP. It would nullify it if I got the 300 AP. Is any other elemental material higher than that? I think Barrett's got the other one. No. 300 AP is a lot though. That would take me a minute. I'd have to do some like grinding for that. Nah, it's probably not worth it. We'll just do the half damage, it's fine. Yeah, well, I, I can see that Yuffie's pretty strong. Let's see, critical art rate, wind damage up. Is there anything like, Hands Tempest, nah. Okay, we're fine. With Comet. And then, Petrify should be good enough, honestly. I don't think they're immune to stone. Though I don't remember for sure. We'll have to wait and see. Let's give it a shot. This can be a little tough too because they have a lot of um, these fireballs have a lot of if they're the bombs that I think they are, they have a lot of interrupting attacks. And Aerith has not been known to be very quick. Like once you get Radiant Ward down, she's a little bit faster. But I guess I could get a Lustrous Shield up and maybe it'll block it. Yeah, see, this is already bad. We can get Phoenix up, I guess, but I think they absorb fire, right? They're just immune. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Quake's pretty strong. Uh, let's just pray and heal back up. Just get distance and then put the... Um, Shield back up. How about you back off? Stop it! Get him! Look up! One more shot! Way faster in this war. Get 
Yeah, they just added material load up to 16 as well, so like... Strong odds that we'll see it soon. Probably harder than it needed to be, but that's okay. I the thing that annoys me is I should be able to change it here. Like, don't make me go out of the thing and then redo it. You know, I should be able to. It's a menu. Like, let me redo it in the menu. Let's get her. Um. Shit back. I didn't actually see what Barrett's walking up against, to be honest. He will probably be just fine, though. Got a hankering for blood. You hear the joke? Yeah, thankfully, because I'm streaming it, all I have to do is go back to the VOD, so. <laughs> Makes my life pretty easy. Wind Sages, it said? Oh, Zemzalets. Um. So much easier. <laughs> Lord. Forty six seconds, tough one. Alan Gus's next party guess into the dark and continue your path to domination. The Undertaker? You chick. You chick. I don't watch your deal. That's what you sound like. <laughs> I wasn't going to give her the assess earrings because I've not had to assess anything yet. But like the one time I don't will be the time I need it. Joppy, welcome on anger to see you. Happy Monday. Hope you're doing well. Hope you had a nice weekend. Doing pretty well. She have a healing material on right now? What did I steal from? Oh, I stole the gravity material from her, right? And that's your deal. You hear the party hard with Tifa. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got.
Okay. <laughs> All right. Last one. I assume this is with Cloud, right? Yeah. The Bloodstained Jester. That's his final party. Guess can claim victory. Okay. Challenge. Oh, now he says challengers are always welcome, huh? Oops. All right, and she had the psychic charm on. She had the Crescent Moon Charm. He had the Koopo Charm, which the Koopo Charm we probably don't even need to use anymore, to be brutally honest, but like... And then Yuffie, Yuffie had uh, better stealing equipped on. I wonder if I'm better off giving her to Steadfast Block. Maybe a Crescent Moon Charm of her own. Defeating an enemy, that's just okay. Something that increases. Maybe the Whistlewind Scarf would be good, too. I'm using... Oh, this would be really good. The, um... Speed Demon Keychain. <laughs> that's good, too. Yeah, this is probably the best one. Because that lets her charge up ATP pretty quick. Okay. All right, Cloud, you're up. Kafka, that would be wild. Can you imagine? This is probably, uh, you remember that enemy in Final Fantasy VII OG that sent out the um, the cards? That's probably what this is. The one that could possibly heal you or possibly one hit KO you. Who could have expected an upset like this? We haven't seen that one yet. The knife's team has made it to the finals, but playtime's over. This here's the real moment of truth. Are you ready? I want to hear some noise, people. Give it up for everyone's nightmare. The Murder Machine Supreme. No yeah. Cool design. Does our Merc and his crew have what it takes to be the first? Will they be able to claim our darling little grand prize? You're about to find out, folks. This is the moment we've been waiting for. I still want to point out how easy Barrett's was. Hey, this one we have to assess. <laughs> I don't have the I don't have the thing that takes those off. Gus's cursed ace in the hole, an evil jester that has bathed itself in its blood of it in the blood of its enemies. Feeds on the souls of its opponents while drawing cards that foretell the future. Evading soul sucker will force it to extract energy from itself and enter a pressured state, which we missed we thought we didn't dodge it, obviously. Once its HP drops low enough and it goes berserk, it will remain pressured. Interesting. Not immune to sleep. <laughs> That's like a really hard thing to touch. Yeah, like they did a really good job. Does heart still heal me? No, it heals it. Okay, great. How would I dodge that even? Let's see if I can sleep. Sweet dreams. I'm using this to let its barriers fall down.
wonder if it changes its weaknesses. If it doesn't, then we can actually switch our stuff over to, um... I don't think that'll matter. I was gonna say, I wonder if it's immune to silence, but it doesn't look like it is. I guess we could, um, berserk it, but I feel like that would also be bad. Let's put regen down. Great. All right, three, two, one, go. Maybe you just have to dodge at the right point instead of like spamming it. Space is gonna hurt. Hold ATB until it staggers itself, refreshes itself. I thought it said it, if you dodged it, it did it on itself. Did I read that wrong? It's not pressure. any good i'll put it down anyways but like i should have odin on cloud yeah he keeps sucking my soul it's not very nice Cool. This is a fun fight. Was never in doubt. And obviously, if you go in there with the uh, the wind material attached to elemental, it makes that even easier. Panic boom was good enough though. Yeah, well, GGs. Hope you're doing well, Jeeves. Gotta say, never thought my little baby would get so thoroughly crushed. Good. Do you oh. have any idea how much kill I spent on that thing? You inconsiderate son of a bitch! I really don't care. <laughs> I really don't care. What do you say? We make one hell of a team. clean up at the fight. Yeah, I'm pretty tired too. I feel that. Absolutely not, Gus. Go to hell. Yeah, the boy! Hell no. Oh, Atta boy. So you really were after our little prize. You so are turned off. Well, you're welcome to her. You earned it. Just as a little show of good faith. Go a whittle. And then maybe think over that deal. Smack him with the broad side of your sword. Hey. Huh? Hello. Where did you come from, beautiful? You looking to get in good with the Gus man? <laughs> Adam, Adam, girl, let's go! Yes! <laughs> Don't ever pull this crap again. You offer any more people as prizes, they'll have to scrape you off my shoe. Got it? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Jesus. The loveliest of ladies got a key item. Right? She probably held back. <laughs> so, how did the reunion go? Reunion?
opinion. Different girl. Oh no. Was just a random tourist from Midgar. I mean, good still, but saucer, damn. And ended up down here. I sent her back up, made sure she's safe. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't be. I'll find her eventually. I'm sure of it. Anyway, what's next for you and the others? We're looking for something too. Need to find it ASAP. Hmm. <laughs> Funny. Always the same story with us. 2027, that's right. Probably 2028 if we're being real. Nice, we got much more SP. It's time for Tifa. Thanks, Thanks, Leslie. And you. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, Tifa can't get any better than she is right now, so. I mean, thanks, though. All right, so now we're done with the side quest in the Corral region. Oh, man, I guess we should just go back to the grasslands, huh? Just start from the beginning and work our way up. Max's business. Uh, well, it looks like this one might be. <laughs> I say this one might be short, but it might not be. <laughs> Let's go say hi to Beck. I don't know anything that was fucking quick in this region. <laughs> wow. Beck's business? That's right, buddy. And right now, we just so happen to be looking to hire new talent. Say, since you're here, how about I pencil you in for an interview? Sound good? Ooh, yeah. Sign him up, boss. Of course. So you gotta He's get penciled? Penciled. Hell no. <laughs> so, respective employee. Yes, Beck. First things first. What is your full name? Dakota, welcome on in. Cloud Strife. Cloud Strife. Seriously? Yeah, I'm gonna entertain Cloud it. Strife. Nice name. Real poetic. Next up, I'm gonna need your employment history. Done odd jobs for people. Uh -huh. A month, you say? That mean you're willing to do anything so long as the pay's good? Maybe. <laughs> Sorry. As you know, we here at Beck's Business make a living by slaying fiends and keeping folks safe. If you were to join us, what sort of skills would you bring to the table? <laughs> Comic relief, S control, guerrilla marketing. Comic relief. Uh, so, you don't look funny. And that's why he gets laughed. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just confer with my associates. Hey, once we can get this shrub to do all the heavy lifting for us, our monster troubles are over, boys. After thorough deliberation, our council has decided to approve your candidacy. Congratulations. Congratulations. At least I can get hired somewhere, baby. Let's go. Your accomplishments speak for themselves, Mr. Strife. Indeed, I think you have the potential to become a mentor to your new colleagues. Welcome to the BB family. I'm your superior, and you're my superior. <laughs> oh, Lord. We've got some big expectations for you, rookie. Okay. Now that the formalities are out of the way, it's time for your first assignment. Okay. There's an old highway on the outskirts of town. I've seen it. Go on ahead and prep the battle while you're at it. We've got some uh, paperwork. You sure. Are serious about this, are you? I am. Are you always serious? Never know. Could be a nice change of pace. You gotta start wearing a mask too. Maybe I will bear it. What up, Pico? Do I 
need to walk here? Probably not. Am I gonna do it anyway? You bet your sweet ass I am. They just wolves. Half of Beck's business. Let's get to work. Hey, newbie! How's it looking over there? You done with our work? We ain't done shit! God damn it, was hoping they'd be dead. We just what? got here. Alright. Aren't these just grassland wolves? I mean. Well, there's this many of them, it's a bit of a pain in the booty, but too bad. That's fair. Let's do this. You know, I get the feeling I'm not. Outlaws who race across the grasslands, abandoned roads on modified motorcycles. They are passionate men who care deeply for their fellow outcasts. They're weak to lightning. Oh, I didn't know that. Did y'all know there was a second page that told you what their attacks are? Huh. It does say toggle data down there. I guess I didn't even think to... Oh, and there's a whole icon key. Huh. Well, isn't that something? <laughs> Learn something new every day. Anyways. Right. <laughs> Which, for what it's worth, is user error, not not game error. But yeah, cheers, Styles, and happy birthday again, buddy. It's good to see you. Hope you had a great day. Static shock. Come on, come find me, fool. Go ahead and just use the um, heal and switch to Tifa. Go, body, come back. <laughs> Focus 
after us. Yeah, never mind. This feels normal. We're back on pace. Thanks, back. No more secret side quest opened up in the grasslands. So that's done. Take a peek at Junon. If I was a side quest, where would I be? It's going to be in Junon then. What up? Thanks to that Lodbrock guy and his little speech. The town's so riled up I can't get a moment's peace. She's gonna take the fight to Shinra, that's what. Sorry. I guess we should probably check the um Dave's Chocobo Express! Oh, that's right. That's how you were supposed to get back to, like, um... You didn't have to go through the mithril mines again. Let's check the weapon vendor really quick. So, I was talking with a sailor friend of mine, and he said those were all guys who managed to board the ship. I said just... <laughs> what can I do you for? Nothing. You got old shit. Thought you might have some new stuff. You ain't got shit. You take care of yourself, okay? Yeah, thanks. I appreciate it. <laughs> All right, where's the board at? Here we go. Oh, it's Priscilla. Grownups have been talking about war with Wu Tai a lot lately, and it's been getting my really getting my friends down. I want to try and take their minds off it all. Do something fun. But I'm not sure what. If anyone has any ideas, I'm all ears. All right. Go say hi to Priscilla. Another day in a life without sunshine. So, is 
there really going to be another people? war? I don't know, but... Oh, hey, mister. Hey, Yuffie. Hmm? You guys are looking grim. Somebody die? The <laughs> grown-ups are saying there's going to be a war soon. A real bad one, too. And because we're right below Junon, everyone's worried we're going to get hit first. Don't worry. It's a fair concern. Although Junon doesn't really have any strategic value. I mean, it would get taken along with the rest of the city. Wow. <laughs> so long as you don't piss off the occupying forces, they probably wouldn't beat the crap out of you. He's so good well, with kids. I hope that doesn't happen, because it sounds horrible. <laughs> <laughs> um, more importantly, how long has it been since we last saw each other? We should make the most of this lucky little reunion. That'd be great. But what should we do? Hmm. Ah, I got it. <laughs> Squeak. Our adorable dolphin friend and this guy are going to put on the most spectacular show ever. Am I? Who's ready for a good time? Yay! I already don't remember how to do this. Oh boy. Avoid the cove's obstacles while striking the floating beach balls to get Mr. Dolphin excited and increase his swimming speed. Cross the finish line in record time to impress the children. More dark matter. You're gonna do great. Yeah, no kidding, right, Larry? I just have to steer, right? Yeah. Ow. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> All right, can I have a redo? Oh. That was not very clear for me in particular. Here we go. is like not very well labeled <laughs> either that or I'm blind which is like totally fair but No Hydro Thunder, yeah. <laughs> well, at least I'm not alone. That makes me feel better. Rank B, we're going to have to redo that. Gotta say, I was pretty worried for a sec. I had a fun time watching, though. It's funny how much you suck. No one's ever rules. satisfied, dude. <laughs> Why don't you get on the fucking dolphin and show me how it's done, kid? We hope you enjoy the show. But even if you didn't, you still gotta pay. That'll be one orb a piece, kiddos. Pony up. What? Well, I don't have any. What a rip off. <laughs> <laughs>
wasn't gonna be that easy, dude. <laughs> Alright, where's the next one? It's right back at the board again. Okay, we just walk back up there. I should let's try running this back one time. Just for the one time. Everyone's waiting for minute 40 we are at a minute 53 considering i ran into like 17 walls i get the feeling we'll probably be better this time yeah we'll give it one more time i think we got it this time Um, okay. That's probably bad. good no we didn't get the star there's 140 right hitting those two uh cones back to back got us okay i said one more i'm doing two if we fuck it up this time we'll stop Beaten. I think we got it. Yeah, let's go. Done. Give me my dark matter. well i did it for you three times come on <laughs> now that's what i call pod racing let's go i'm 
All right. It's the next side quest. Let's do this. You got. Midgar 7th Infantry, Junon Crater Cape. Be advised, Fearsome Fiend is presently contained within Crater Cape. Civilians are strongly encouraged to avoid the area until the threat has been addressed. Active duty and retired military requested to render assistance. <laughs> All right. Crater Cape was over here, right? Yep. Y'all ready to see the Midgar 7th Infantry again? Oh, we have to go around, huh? <laughs> you earned it, sir! Captain? Oh, wow, it's really you! <laughs> Seventh Infantry, right? It's good to see you again, Captain. You here to offer support? Absolutely. Something like that. Sit, Rep. Sir, we managed <laughs> to contain a dangerous fiend in the sector up ahead. But said fiend proved more formidable than expected. So we were awaiting reinforcements. And imagine our surprise when you showed up. The target seems to have settled down, but there's no telling when it'll act up again. Now's the I'm about to act up. To take the thing out. Suppose we ought to lend him a hand, huh? Hell yeah, brother. Let's go. All right, Captain. Follow us. Why are they here? <laughs> you. The hell is that? Fall back now, sir. That's cool as shit. An artificial monstrosity created by Shinra's R&D division as part of horrific experiments meant to combine man and beast. It was being held in the underwater reactor's research facility, but managed to escape. Huh. Get ready. Was hard down. Yeah, it's a neat look. They did a good job. Bye-bye. You lost your tail. Where are you going? Stop that feed. It could kill countless civilians. Better 
chocobo could trap the scent. You're on it? Yeah. Good. We'll return to Juno. The garrison needs to be informed about the situation. That thing's vicious. Go get him, ma'am. Give it the chance, and it'll rip your heads clean off. So make sure you beat it to the punch. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Bye, we'll tail. Back up with you once we finish our report. Till then, Captain. Till then, troopers. Follow this up, or is it okay? I do. Quit. I'll come in, Starchy. Go over the water. Going for a swim. doing oh there you You want to come over here and fight, or are you just going to hide behind the fucking thing? Hello? Get him! Too much? It's your turn. Okay, let's go. All right. You ready? I almost used self-destruct. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we saw it go up there. That checks out. What? <laughs> All right. Here we go. I think we're gonna pass by a uh, stall. That'd be dope. 
I like healing. Go left. It didn't go left. All right, hold on a sec. I can't get up there, can I? Where's that? All right. Fine. Good. Okay. Doop, 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 doop. intentional let's just heal here we've got enough potions it doesn't really matter It's starting to look like it's going to be all the way back in Kyrie section. Oh, never mind, it's right here. That's Reflect on. But it's immune to... Oh, that range attack's magic attack. Got it. to like dispel yet so I can't get rid of this I've only gotten like deep reach or whatever deep protect now it's switched over You're out of luck. 
Let's switch it up. I'll show you what I can do. Let's be smart. Um. Yeah, I don't have any ways to like break the thing, so I just have to basically just keep hitting it with physical attacks. It's really unfortunate that I have Aerith in this fight at all, to be honest. Let's get Kujan out. Get him. Get him. Because if I had Yuffie, I'd be sad. Yeah, how did you know? <laughs> Excellent work out there. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> Something on your mind, trooper? Very well. Permission to speak granted. Uh, what's the seventh infantry still doing out here? What's the seventh infantry still doing out here? Figured you guys would have been shipped back to Midgar by now. Normally, I wouldn't answer that sort of question, but why not? The brass ordered us to remain behind following the ceremony. Anything else? What was with that beam? That little hellion back there was a bioweapon developed by R&D with the cooperation of advanced weaponry. They were keeping it in that underwater facility of theirs, but it managed to escape during a recent incident. Our investigations are ongoing, hmm. but we suspect the Shinra Resistance Committee was involved. Oh, gotcha. Operations? Nope, not at all. <laughs> Can you brief me on the mission? Our orders were to neutralize the fleeing fiend and ensure the safety of the local populace. While we succeeded in locating the target and keeping it contained within an isolated area, it was too tough to take on. After we parted ways with you, we hurried back to Junon and called for additional reinforcements. But our calls went unanswered. There just aren't enough troopers to go around. That's bullshit. There's plenty of troopers. They just didn't want to help because they heard we were fraternizing with the enemy. They may operate as independent cells, but it seems they communicate regularly. While well, united by their desire to take down Shinra, the how and why of it varies considerably between factions. It's fair. Some see civilian casualties as acceptable collateral damage, or our fault. I've no doubt these extremists sick that monster on the city. Such scum deserve nothing less than to be trapped in a room full of tomberries. <laughs> Valid. As somebody that's been trapped in a room full of tomberries, I can tell you it's not great. Might have gotten completely out of hand, but you managed to bring it under control. Thank you, ma'am. You did good out there today. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> I must say, in all my wildest dreams, I never thought I'd have a soldier in my ranks. One who keeps such unusual company at that. Suspected terrorists. A Utaya ninja. An escaped lab rat. And... An ancient. Uh oh. At ease. We're heading home. I need to report today's events. How the Seventh Infantry resolved the crisis on its own. Yep. So you're not gonna tell them about us? No. But you best leave before I change my mind. Otherwise, I might just strap you to the back of a dragon. You can try. Assuming we all live long enough, there's a chance we may meet again someday. Though let's hope for your sakes that it isn't on the field of battle. They're gonna be on the sub, huh? 
They're gonna be on a sub, huh? Yeah, she is. Salute! At ease, true. We're good this time. We're done. All right. That was the last side quest in Junon. So now Grasslands and Junon are officially complete. We have six side quests left to go. <laughs> so the next time we play, we're going to be going through the last couple of side quests. And we're going to be doing uh, the final three Queen's Blood matches, which I think there'll be a fourth one um, and possibly a fifth one as well. But that's going to be the game plan for Saturday. We're going to get through the rest of the side quests, get through the rest of the Queen's Blood, and then we'll be heading into the Meridian Ocean for two reasons. One, to find the uh, the pirate's treasure, because that's one of the discovery quests. And then the other is to get the last bit of uh, intel. That might not be till Sunday, but we'll, uh, we'll definitely be looking forward to that for sure. YouTube, if you made it this far, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. If you haven't already, make sure you like the video, comment, and subscribe. Looks like we're nearing the end of all the side content and the... Um, the intel content in final fantasy 7 rebirth so it feels like we're getting close to the end folks appreciate y'all tuning in hope you enjoyed thanks for being here everybody and as always we'll see you again in the next one youtube have a great day bye